well, you know, it's that, I think it's just been a bit, a little bit tentative, you know, we've just been trying to smooth out a few creases, but do you know what, they're in good spirits and, you know, they've had a really good run out. Um, Liana, unfortunately, isn't with us on Saturday, but obviously she's, she's had lots of input in the last two weeks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, she's our head coach and, you know, she set the programme out before she um, had to sort of like depart very, very quickly for, for, for personal reasons. But we're still on with the plan that she's devised and the girls are just stepping up to it beautifully. Oh, I think it's, a, it's, it's an exciting time for us here at Rhinos Netball because we've got some, some youth within the group who just energise the whole group. And that's not to say that, um, you know, the rest of the, the group that are a little bit more experienced, but the, the youngsters are, are adding that, that, that little bit of shake of spice within the group. And it's, it's fabulous to have them. They're like sponges, they're wanting to take it all in and they're learning from the experienced players around them. Two signings haven't been able to join us. Could you just give us a little update on that? Yeah, it's our South African um, um, imports. I don't think it's any secret that, you know, that they are uh, at the moment just having um, injuries that they're dealing with and that they're managing and South African Netball have their sports science team wrapped all around them making sure that they're okay and we hope to see them very soon. We've got a real good setup up here everyone because it's given an opportunity for some of our training partners to come into the squad and they've been training with us all pre-season anyway. Yeah absolutely, they've, all, they've been in the mix since October pre-season. I don't think any of them would have expected to get the shout to play on Saturday but you know the the fact that we do have injuries it's just a factor of the sport of any sport is injury but the door that opens for those that aren't injured that maybe didn't expect to play it's an opportunity that they will seize and, and, and just run with. And just finally London Pulse um, a team that have got lots of internationals including our former player Jade Clark. what a way to start the competition. Couldn't get any better really could it you know there are going to be tough games this season the the movers and the shakers throughout the off season have seen the balance really across quite a lot of the teams so whereas historically you know you maybe got one team that had a little bit more strength than their opposition well I think that things are going to be a little bit more balanced this season so it's going to be a good one it's going to be a tough one but that's what we play the game for. Excellent. Thank